Hi everyone, and welcome to Grape House Battery Monday. My name is Zach, and today we're going to talk about the difference between a BMS and a PCM to help you determine which one is better suited for your projects. Now, before we go straight into comparing these protection boards, let me help define them first. So generally speaking, battery protection boards can be divided into two types. We usually refer to them as the PCM, protection circuit module, or otherwise known as the PCB, the protection circuit board, and the BMS, which is the battery management system. So a battery management system, BMS, or protection circuit module, PCM, is one of the most important parts of a lithium battery. Without either one of these two components, a lithium battery could be very dangerous. The PCM is mainly composed of hardware electronic components, and it protects the charging and discharging of the lithium battery pack. When the pack is fully charged, the PCM can ensure that the voltage difference between the single cells is less than the set value in order to achieve balanced voltages between the different cells. And at the same time, the PCM will detect the overvoltage, undervoltage, overcurrent, short circuit, and over temperature status of every single cell in the battery pack to ultimately protect and extend the battery's life. The BMS, also called the battery manager, maintains the same features as a PCM and PCP, but also has the ability to offer additional protection and features. It provides real-time monitoring of the battery and transmits data through the software. The status information is given to the electrical equipment, and the BMS itself includes a management system, a control module, a display module, a wireless communication module, and a collection module for collecting battery information of the battery pack and others. Electric shavers and power tool batteries are protected with the PCM and PCP. Drone batteries, on the other hand, utilize a BMS, and the drone operator will have the ability to check the battery level in real time and calculate the remaining runtime of the battery. This requires a battery to support these data transmissions, which can only be offered by a BMS. Okay, so which solution is better for your project? Well, the PCM and the PCP can only offer the basic levels of protection and are cheaper, whereas the BMS includes all the functionalities of a PCM and PCB and more, although that price tag will go up. So, if we're trying to decide between these boards, it really depends on exactly what market your product would be geared towards. If you still can't make a decision, please feel free to reach out to us and we'll help you. So, that is all for today. If you have any questions about today's topic or have any battery related things you'd like to know, please feel free to contact us by email at info at Until then, my name is Zach, and thank you for watching.